And last but not least, it's time to create the footer. So, zoom in a little, make the guides visible. And again, another 20 pixels distance between them. Okay, and we want this footer to be about 650 by 240. And let's position it. We also want this footer to be that green color, so with the color picker, just pick the color. And there we go. And now that's left is just to write the footer text. Let's just group it and rename it footer. And this should be footer BG. And let's duplicate the mailbag refresh logo. There we go. Matt J. And I'll just drag them all the way. Yeah. And this should say mail bakery name. And this should be white instead of yellow. So just outline about 40 pixels distance. Move these two to be aligned. You can also group them and position them according to the background, like so. Now you can group them. And for the other text, Create a new layer, type tool, and your font should be Arial Regular 12 point and 20 line spacing. Also change the color to F1, F1, F1. And I'm just going to paste the text. Let's position it in the middle. It can be like one, two, 20 pixels from the logo. And create a new text field that's constrained within these guys and paste the text. And there you have it. A simple, fresh, and clean email template you can use for any of your marketing needs. Thank you for watching our tutorial on how to design a newsletter template part one. Stay tuned for part two and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.